Hey, what is up guys? It's Josh. Welcome to another video. On today's video, I'm going to be talking about how I schedule classes for my college degree here. So basically, to get a degree, you have a list of classes that you need to take and there is a minimum grade that you need to earn in each of those classes. Now, some of the classes are only offered in certain times. Some of them are offered only on fall. Some of them are offered only on spring. So you really have to take note of which classes do what. Most importantly, some classes build off of each other. So for example, you have to take class A before you take class B. Simple stuff like that, there are just small and minute details but are very critical. So today I'm gonna show you guys how I actually do it. I made a list of the classes that I'm gonna take from my very first semester until my very last semester. That way I know what classes I'm taking and it's just very clear, like the path is set clear and I don't have to worry about anything. You know how to plan things out. Okay, I want to cramp most of my general classes on my freshman year and leave my senior year for the minimum credit hours. So those kind of things that are very important for you. Speaking of scheduling, I am scheduling right now for my upcoming semester which starts Tuesday and I am quite nervous honestly so after the first set that I've told you guys which is to set up all the classes that you want to take from your very first semester until your very last semester then you would have to search and type in the code of the name so say I'm taking basic English first EM 121 that's the code for us and there are a couple of classes that are here that you can take and so something that I actually really like about being here in college is that you get to set your own schedule after you've scheduled your classes there are a list of books that you need to buy a thousand dollars frick all right so that's it that's how you schedule for your classes and now we're gonna go buy books let's go <coughs> is this thing on you see the card number and then there are a lot of numbers here and you just go find your number pretty smart that's neat though i think mm -hmm. it's pretty nice so you don't have to actually look for a lot of stuff so number 11 Dang, these books are thick, dude. Four pack? <gasps> the freak! <laughs> Four pack. This is my lab report. I'm gonna die. Got the one. One good night is worth a thousand words. One good girl is worth a thousand birds. Just travel the world and make a thousand first. The way you moving got me. Gotta be so broke after this, guys. <laughs> Hey guys, so I actually found a website called Library Genesis. I'm gonna put the link down there and it saved me a lot of money. I forgot to tell you guys how to use this. So basically just go to the website and then type in your title of the title of your book that you want it to and then um, search it. Make sure that the edition is the right one. Make sure that it's the one that you want and afterwards you click on the right edition the one that you want and then and then you just click on it and then it will slowly load as uh, the book cover actually loads up by itself and then afterwards you would have to just basically save it save to your save to files that's what it is but yeah that's how it is uh, I save like five textbooks it's free online I'm gonna I'm gonna share it to you guys so you guys can save a lot of money too and yes that is it for today thank you so much for watching and i hope your scheduling goes well good luck for the new semester i'll see you guys in the next one yes sir notifications on yes sir always and another thing i like